The New York Knicks are heating up at the right time. They've won six games in a row as they head into Indiana to take on Tyler Hansborough and the Pacers. We take you straight into the second quarter. Amari Stoudemire still sitting this one out with that ankle problem. Mike Dunleavy Jr. on the wing, floating it high and bringing it home, six of 11 from the field. Then Josh McRoberts, nice little up and under move. He draws the foul as well. He had nine points off the bench as Carmelo Anthony falls hard on the ground. Still second quarter, Danny Grange knocking down a jumper. He had 17 points in the first half alone. Indiana up 56-49, New York missing, but they get their offensive rebound and get it out to Chauncey Billups, and he delivers two of six from deep. We're tied at 56, still second quarter, still Chauncey Billups. Billups had 15 in the first half of the game. Knicks up 67-61. Look at the crossover from Darren Collison. Gets inside, tough move from Collison. He had 16, the Knicks up by six though. Later in the third, Darren Collison takes it to the basket for another lay-in, just five of 14 from the field, but he makes a lot of them when they're one foot away from the basket. Later in the third, it's Paul George inside with the one-handed jam. He had six points and the Pacers up by three. End of the third quarter, time running out. Roy Hibbert hits a nice little jump hook. Indiana goes up by six. Mike Dunleavy Jr. steals the inbound pass. Where's A.J. Price? Give me A.J. Price for three. He delivers, and the Pacers go up by nine. At the end of the third quarter, they had scored 96 points through three quarters. Into the fourth quarter we go, and the Knicks start to heat up. Tony Douglas knocking down a jump shot. That cuts the lead down to five. Carmelo Anthony was money from distance. Six of 13 on his three-point shooting. Indiana's lead down to three, 103-100. Plenty of time left for the Knicks. Darren Collison turning it over. Indiana up by three, 40 seconds to go, but it doesn't matter. Landry Fields cuts that right down to 140 seconds in the game, 109-108. And it's the Pacers on top. Now 20 seconds to go, same score. Darren Collison dribbling, dribbling. Has to beat the shot clock, gets it off the front of the rim, but clanks that thing. So the Knicks call a timeout. Who do you think they go to? Why not? Carmelo Anthony, so tough to guard in a one-on-one -on -one situation. He pulls and nails it. Mello just drilling the shot there. Knicks go up by one, 110 to 109. That's what they brought him in for. He can isolate in the playoffs and get off a shot anytime he wants to. Now the Pacers with a chance to win this thing though. Five seconds left, Danny Granger goes up and is rejected by Mello. Darren Collison's shot, his desperation shot is no good. And New York has won seven games in a row. They go into Indiana and take this one by a single. Final score, 110 to 109.